Yes, you were the Lord. Moses, yes, you were the Lord. Moses, yes, you were the Lord. Yes, you are the Lord. Mighty God. Yes, you are the Lord. Yes, you are the Lord. Most of yes, you are the Lord. Yes, you are the Lord. Lift your voice and worship Him. Most of Almighty God. Yes, you are the Lord. You are. Most of Hosanna. Oh, bless her, be the Lord. Let the rock of my salvation be exalted. Hosanna, 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 bless her, be the Lord. Let the rock of my salvation be exalted. I we call upon. your voice and worship the almighty God, the all-powerful, the almighty, the unchangeable changer, the God that answered by fire, the all-knowing, the all-seeing God. Lift up your voice and bless his holy name for another glorious day, another wonderful morning, for counting us among the living, for the good thing the Lord is doing and has done. Let's give him glory for backing and support, for hearing our cry, for answering our prayer, for joining message. Let's thank the Almighty God for deliverances. Let's thank the Almighty God for victory upon victory. Let's thank the Almighty God for his plan and purpose for our life. Let's thank him for favor. Let's thank him for helping us thus far. Let's thank him for the work of our hand, for prospering the work of our hand. Let's thank him. Let's thank him for destroying every cancer of your godly over our life. Hey, Papo Lema Shantale, Brande Kasantale, Mama. Can you lift up your voice and just appreciate God this morning? Thank you for good hair. Thank you for strength. 
thank him thank him for his wonders thank him for miracles thank him for testimonies lord we are grateful almighty father we are grateful king of glory we are grateful thank you 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 almighty father papola prado koto ka gente no amaka sontali kamale bato gazantalia lord we say thank you thank you for good morning holy spirit thank you for what he's doing in our midst thank you for what he said to do this morning thank you because our god will not be in vain thank you because he will hear our cry oh mercy pole ma chantalia bless be the name of jesus in jesus most wonderful name we have prayed I thought someone would say a better amen, a louder amen. Lift up your voice and say, Father, because it is written that the blood of Jesus speaks better things than the blood of Abel. This morning, O oh God, Father, let the blood of Jesus speak on my behalf. Let it speak forgiveness. Let it speak mercy. Let it speak grace. Let it speak answer prayers. Let it speak deliverance. Let it speak vengeance. Can you go ahead and plead the blood? Plead the blood, plead the blood, plead the blood. The blood that speaks better things <laughs> than the blood of Abel. Masuka leba shentalia. Kakada labato ga shentalia. Zubale mato gabaka sentele mama. Zumaye kete ga zunta lebra no ka santalia. Let the blood speak on our behalf, O God. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus, most wonderful name, we have prayed. Amen. I trust someone will say a better amen. amen. Put your hands together for the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. The omnipotent, omnipresent, omniscience, Lord. The all knowing, the all seeing God. Is that all you can do? Is that all you can do? Daniel chapter 6, verse 27. He delivered and rescued, and he worked signs and wonders in heaven and in earth. May he wrought wonders in your life. Who have delivered Daniel from the power of the lions? God will deliver you from the powers of every lion roaring against your destiny in the name of Jesus. Spiritual lions, physical lions, God will deliver you. Human lions, God will deliver you in the name of Jesus. You want to start by lifting up your two hands to heaven and say, Father, you alone can deliver and rescue. Lord, deliver and rescue my destiny from destruction. Lord, let nothing be able to destroy my destiny. Let nothing be able to destroy the destiny of my children. Lord, deliver and rescue me today from the hands of the wicked, from the hands of enemies stronger than me. Can you go ahead and pray for yourself that God will deliver and rescue you from the hands of enemies stronger than you? Ah, man, lipo tagazanta li baba. Zazale, kato brando kata gazanta li mama. Shimpanta lagade. Lord, rescue my destiny. Rescue, 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 rescue my life. Ah, Maripa Kasun Taliana. That the enemy will not see our end. Brethren, cry to the Almighty God. I don't know where the enemy have banished you. I don't know where the enemy have kept you. Add the Lord to rescue you this morning. Let the Almighty God rescue you. Kapole Brande Kasun Talimama. That he rescue us today. King of glory, rescue us today. Palibote Gaza Pale Mama Shentele Mama Zizala Buska Taliana. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' mighty name, you shall be delivered. In Jesus' mighty name, the Lord will rescue you. In the name of God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit. Lift up your two hands one more time and say, Father, your word it is written. You walk at signs and wonders. In heaven and in earth. Therefore, O oh God, in my life, in my business, in the life of my children, in my home, in my family, Lord, perform signs and wonders. 
walk signs and wonder. Turn our life to a wonder. Go ahead, church of the Almighty God. God Almighty, He walks signs and wonder in heaven and in earth. So you want to lift up your voice and ask Him to walk signs and wonder in your life today. Lord, walk signs and wonders in our life today. Walk signs and wonders in our midst today. Walk signs and wonders in the works of our hand. Walk signs and wonder in our ministries. Lord, walk signs and wonder even in our nation. Walk signs and wonder in your church. Do ballet, katuga, balamash and chilele, prokoto, gazika ka, babonde le mato, gashinta li mama, zazala boto kaprande, kuka bale gaga ba shentelele. Daddy walk signs and wonder. Lord 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 walk signs and wonder. Almighty Father walk signs and wonder. Papa le prado koto gashinta li mama. Daddy walk signs and wonder. Oh, walk signs and wonder. Kapole Prado Kasanta Limama. Thank you, mighty Father. In hey, Jesus, mighty name, we have prayed. Who had delivered Daniel from the powers of the lions? Lift up your two heads and say, Father, I don't know the lions roaring at me. You that delivered Daniel from the powers of lions. Deliver me from the powers of my enemy. Lord, deliver me and my entire household. Deliver my destiny from the powers of my enemy. Can you go ahead and talk to the mighty God that the Lord will deliver you today from the powers of your enemies? That they deliver us, O God, from the powers of our enemy. Let our enemies not see our end. Let our enemies not rejoice over us. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus, mighty name, you are delivered. Now lift up your two hands and say, Father, you can do better. Say, Father, you are the owner of this day. Throughout today and beyond, let only your will be done in my life. Anything the enemy has planned for my life, contrary to your will, I overcome by the blood of Jesus. I say, Oh God, my Father, guide me throughout today, lead me throughout today, help me throughout today. Let your presence go with me. Let me not mourn today. Let me not weep today. Let me not be frustrated today. Let this not be hard for me today. Lord, arise from my help. Have mercy. Oh, Marita Tatalaboska. Zipota Gaga Daga Dekata. Lord, you are the owner of this day. <laughs> Let only whatever you permit happen to me today. Kaka Baba. Happen to my wife and my children. <laughs> happen to every member of City of Life. Calibro do Cosanta. Lord, do not permit the wicked to hijack my day. Do not permit the wicked to interfere in the affairs of my life. Lord, take absolute control. Lord, take total preeminence. Lord, take charge concerning me today. Kakaba libo to Gazanda. Oh, Borimate Gazabrado Kota Gazanda. Jibale Gazikaka. Frustrate all our enemies today. Zazale <laughs> baba baba. Destroy their powers for our sake. Kakuta la Let all this work in our favor. <laughs> Let all this cooperate with us today. Hey, Kakaba la boshiata li mama. Zazala bosh ketele baba. Zubale katu gaga mashen taliani. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus, most wonderful name, we are praying. Now, finally, lift up your two hands and say, Father, you are the great promoter. Before the end of this month, I want to experience you. I want to experience promotion, financial promotion, spiritual promotion, material promotion, promotion in my business, promotion in ministry. Lord, you are the great promoter. Let me experience you. Go ahead, talk to the Almighty God. Talk to him that you experience the great promoter in healings, in deliverances. Oh, my Reba Baka Santa Limama. 
Zazala kaba baba ba kashen telele kurama te gaga baba. Lord, let me experience you as the great promoter. Lord, let me experience you as the great promoter that is spiritually. Let me be lifted this morning. Kakuta gaga gaga. Let signs, wonders, miracles follow me on the daily basis. Kaka bruno kasanta liana ke kabolo mo santalia. Lift up every embargo. Lift up every ceiling on our promotions. Kaka bali baba zele kaka. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Oh Lord, to Lagbara, Oshibare Mareo. Oshibare Mareo. Baba Waloke. Oshibare Mareo. Aba ilos kete sa sabale matu kasanda. Oshu bale bale o. Mighty Father, we say good morning. The Creator of heaven and earth, the Creator of all creatures, the Emperor of the universe, the unchangeable changer, the one that speak and it is done. You commanded and he stood fast. Daddy will say, May your name be exalted in the name of Jesus. We are mere mortars in your hand, yet you are mindful of us. Thank you for the miracle of sleeping and waking. Thank you for all you did in our midst yesterday. Thank you for what you did on Monday. Thank you for what you are said to do today. Thank you for our gathering this morning will not be in vain. Thank you because as great promoter you will move in our midst. Father, let it be so in the name of Jesus. Daddy, is there any life? Is there any destiny? Is there any business? Is there any marriage? Is there any family? Ah, going toward destruction. Lord, you will deliver and rescue in the name of Jesus. From the hands of the wicked. I decree wherever my father will hear a louder amen, the Lord will rescue and deliver you in the name of Jesus. The counsel of the wicked shall not stand over your life in the name of Jesus. I decree here today that the God that walks signs and wonders in heaven and on earth will single out your destiny for signs and wonders. We single out your household for signs and wonders. We single out your businesses for signs and wonder. Let God turn you to a wonder in the name of Jesus. The Lord that delivered Daniel from the powers of lions. I decree from the powers of your enemies the Lord will deliver you. I say from the powers of the wicked the Lord will deliver you. You will not be victim of your enemies in the name of Jesus. And as you hand over your day to the owner of the day, may he bless your day. May he arise for your help. May he answer you speedily. May all things work in your favor today. May he make his countenance to shine upon you. May his presence abide with you. May he guide you continually. May he bless the work of your hand today. May he cause you to hear glad tidings today. May he deliver you from whatever evil associated with today. Today things will not be hard for you. Today things will not be difficult for you. Today you will see God in action. I say even your enemies, they will see God in action in your life. In the mighty name of Jesus. You will not be helpless today. I say you will not be helpless today. Any manner of help you need today, it shall come your way. Men will help you. Situations will help you. The road you plan will help you. The vehicle you enter will help you. People that you will meet today, they will be willing to help you. In the mighty name of Jesus, God will order your footsteps arrive. You will be at the right place at the right time. Your leg will not carry you to a wrong place today. Your eyes will not see evil today. Your ears will not hear evil today. The only thing that is permitted to be heard by your ears shall be good news. I say you hear good news from abroad. You hear good news from quarter the matter. In the mighty name of Jesus. 
Sorrow and weeping shall be taken far away from you. Affliction shall be taken far away from you. Your expectation for today shall not be cut short. I say you will not know disappointment today. In the mighty name of Jesus, may the Lord grant your heart desires. Whatever you desire God to do for you today, let God grant them unto you. In the mighty name of Jesus, you will not fail today. You will succeed today. Anything called error and mistake, it shall be taken far away from you. In the mighty name of Jesus, and I decree, wherever my father will hear a louder, amen. Any evil arrow fired at you today, it shall return back to sender. I say it shall return back to sender. Error of failure shall return back to sender. Error of affliction shall return back to sender. Error of lack shall return back to sender. Arrow of sorrow and weeping shall return back to sender. Arrow of destruction shall return back to sender. The head of fire of the most high God shall be around you in the name of Jesus. Today, your hair will not reject blessing. I say today, your hair will not reject blessing. Your life will radiate the glory of God. I say your life will radiate the glory of God. I say your life will radiate the glory of God. In the mighty name of Jesus. Every door shut at you, I command it to be open. Your doors of blessing will remain open. Your doors of breakthrough shall not be shut. In the mighty name of Jesus. Anyone that has taken what belongs to you, I command restoration. Right now, wherever my father will hear a lot of heaven, whoever that have collected from you what belongs to you, either in the physical or in the spiritual, I command restoration now. I say, I command restoration now. I say, I command restoration now. In the mighty name of Jesus, every embargo and ceiling upon your lifting, I command it be lifted in the name of Jesus. Oh, no more embargo upon your life. No more embargo upon your promotion. Embargoes are lifted. In the name of God the Father. God the Son. God the Holy Spirit. Put your head together for Jesus. So I will share the grace of fellowship. Eh? What else again? I saw my daddy. Hello. <laughs> I have this uh, body in my heart that has been lifted. That what brought you here today is already addressed. You are that fellow shouting thunderous hallelujah. You will be remembered for good. Lift up your right hand and say with me. I worship the Almighty God, the only wise God that rules in the affairs of men. He is a living God, steadfast forever, and his dominion has no end. Let the whole earth tremble before him. He speaks, and it is done. He deserves my praise and gratitude all the days of my life. I declare and I confess concerning me and my household that our God can deliver and rescue from all situations. Therefore, He will not abandon us in our challenges. He will surely deliver us from all our troubles and and all our adversaries he will deliver us from all the evils around us the Lord will rescue us from every storm of life and we shall not perish I declare and I confess that my God is the God of signs and wonder he will perform signs and wonders in my life and turn my life to a wonder in my generation. Signs and wonders shall follow me all the days of my life. And to me, the Lord will perform wonders in the life of many. 
I declare and I proclaim that the God that delivered Daniel from the powers of the lions shall deliver me from the power of the wicked. He will deliver me from all my adversaries. He will deliver me from anything assigned to consume me. I will finish well. I will finish strong. My ending shall be far better than my beginning. I will not go to hell. I will reign eternity. I will love the Lord and I will serve the Lord all the days of my life. In Jesus' name. Why I blind the Holy Ghost for a minute? Masuka leba shenta limama. Rabrando to gazika kaba shenta limama. Zalabo te gazinta le baba. Kakute gazunta labrando koto gazente le. Zasalamo te gazianta le makuka ka. Zalabo skete timbalale kazunta. And so shall it be in Jesus' name. Your confession will not be in vain. As you have spoken to the ears of the Almighty God, He will answer you. Yes. I decree that name that is above every other name. Those that will not want your confession to come to power will be the first to congratulate you. Yes. In the name of God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit. Let your amen be louder. Yes. And you say that amen seven powerful times. Yes. Two, yes. three. Yes. Four, five, six, and the loudest. Do I have your permission to prophesy into your life? May you be connected with helpers of your promotion. May you be connected to the helpers of your promotion. You are that fellow, let your email swallow that of your neighbor. I say if you are the fellow, let your aim and swallow the one of your neighbor. Tell your neighbor, my aim has swallowed your own. <laughs> I believe that shout hallelujah. Let me be seated in his presence. You are all welcome in Jesus' name. We are beginning from where we stopped yesterday. And permit me to just spend 15 minutes. But I will rush because I have some very, very serious assignment this morning. Walking into your promotion, that will be your testimony. Exodus chapter 3, verse 1 to 12 is our test. If you don't mind, I'll just read verse 1, maybe to 3, then. Uh, I will jump to 11 and 12. Then you can read the toll when you get back because of time. See, now Moses kept the flock of Jethro, his father in law, the priest of Midian, and he led the flock to the backside of the desert and came to the mountain of God, even to Horeb. And the angel of the Lord appeared unto him in a flame of fire out of the midst of a bush. And he looked, and behold, the bush born with fire and the bush was not consumed and Moses said I will now turn aside and see this great sight why the bush is not burnt verse 11 and Moses said unto God who am I that I should go unto Pharaoh and that I should bring forth the children of Israel out of Egypt I said certainly I will be with thee and this shall be a token unto thee that I have sent thee when thou hast brought forth the people out of Egypt, ye shall serve God upon this mountain. Then Habakkuk 3.19 Habakkuk 3.19 said, The Lord God is my strength. He will make my feet like the his feet and he will make me to walk upon my high places. To the chief singer on my string instruments. Praise the Lord. May the Lord bless the reading of his word in our heart. Lover, we are talking about the great promoter this month. 
And yesterday we started a series walking into your promotion. And we told all that the text that we read, which is Exodus chapter 3, verse 1 to 12, is a typical example of how a man can walk into promotion. You walk into promotion where you encounter the great promoter. Praise the Lord. When you encounter the great promoter, your promotion is uh, inevitable. We told us how Moses was a fugitive, banished to the wilderness, find succor with the father-in-law, and he took up the business of looking after his father-in-law's flocks. But one fateful morning, just like this morning, he woke up and went about his daily routine unknown to him that he was walking into promotion. <laughs> Today is like any other ordinary day, but I decree what will make today to be special for you the great promoter will do it in your life that faithful day was like every other ordinary day but that day turned out to be very special stand on your feet lift up your two hands say father make today special for me Mean it, mean it, mean it, mean it. Pray it, mean it. Mean what you are saying. Mean it. Don't just, don't just say because pastor I ask you to say. Mean what you are saying. Say, Lord, just make today special for me. Just make today special, special, special for me. <laughs> Lord, you can do it. You have done it before. Thank you, mighty Father. And so shall it be in Jesus' name. Be seated in His presence. So oh, then and there, Moses had an encounter with the great promoter. And we told her what promotion is. Praise the Lord. And then we began to consider that there are seven categories of motion or progress. Because when you are talking about promotion, you are talking about being raised up. You are talking about making or recording some advancement. In other words, making progress. It takes promotion for you to make progress. Praise the Lord. And then we look at a particular kind of movement. And it is called a retrogression movement. And we told us that this kind of movement, it could be physical, it could be financial, it could be spiritual, is a state where you find yourself under the influence of two major forces. <laughs> under the influence of any major forces. What is forces number one? Oh, wonderful students. Give yourself a round of applause. Oh, you are learning very fast. And the second forces? Which one is the first one? The pulling down, who and who are there? Your mates, your colleagues, <laughs> those that does not want you to outshine them, those that does not want you to stand out among them. They say, You, you are going nowhere. The more you take step up, the, mm, the happy AG mm, pull him down. Praise the Lord. But I rejoice with you. Because the Bible says, yes, I know the truth. And the truth shall set you free. Now that you know their plans, <laughs> now that you know what they can do, <laughs> in that name that's above every brother name, no pulling down forces shall be able to pull you down. Yeah. When they want to pull you down, they just... They want to pull you down. 
They lied against you. When they want to pull you down, they set one pit trap for you. I am praying for somebody here today. They are cancelled over your life, shall be brought to naught. If you are saying them and say loud and clear. I say if you are saying them and say loud and clear. And then the push it down forces who are in that category. Huh? Your superiors. They don't want you to join them. They don't want you to come to that level of class. And so when you try to raise your head, they give you conk. Mm. Where are you lifting your head to, my friend? Go back there. Let's all the shout hallelujah. <laughs> and what is the solution to that? Oh. You have been doing well. What is the solution to that? Eh? God will overthrow them. Those pushing down forces. For you to be promoted, they can be what? Overthrow. Can I still pray for you? Whoever God needs to remove. <laughs> you didn't hear me loud and clear. Is somebody still with me? Whoever God needs to remove for you to climb up, it shall be a settled matter today. If you are saying amen, say loud and clear. That's why that Psalm 75, the Bible says, God is the righteous judge. He put it down one and lifted the underline that statement, righteous judge. We only put down those that he knows are wicked, like Haman. Haman never wanted Mordecai to come up. Hello? The case of Haman and Mordecai was a typical example of the pushing down syndrome. But what God did? Eh? God, Palermo. Eh. Do you know what they call Palermo? Is a tongue. Mm. Praise the Lord. God cleared him, overthrew him. God cleared Pharaoh. After he cleared Pharaoh, when you get to Exodus chapter 7, verse 1, Exodus chapter 7, verse 1, God now said to Moses, You are no longer ordinary. I have made you God. I made you what? Unto who? Unto Pharaoh. Can I pray for you, sir? When it is time for your promotion, God does certain things. Whatever God needs to do for you to overcome those trying to push you down, may God release it to you in the name of Jesus. So you can actually overcome forces of uh, retrogression. And I pray for you, you will never know retrogression. Now another movement that you must understand in walking into your promotion is the repressive forces. Forces of repression. <laughs> Brother, you will pray. Oh. You will pray. Even if now here I stop today, I'll be satisfied that God have done something. Sir, the repressive forces they tie you down. They did what? They tie you. They tie you. They tie you. They, they ensure you have no any form of movement at all. A typical example can be found in Judges chapter 6, verse 3 to 18. Gideon. And the whole nation of Israel was under repressive forces. The forces of Midianites and the Amalekites who says they will never know promotion. And what do they do? Everything that can bring promotion to them, they come and take it away. And that is why either they have labored, so seed, planted the vineyard at the time of harvest 
when they're supposed to harvest and enter into promotion, when their fortune supposed to change, when their blessings supposed to manifest, they will come and take those things away from them. Many of us are known to you that you are under the influence of repressive forces. You will be saving to do something good. You will be saving to buy a car, to buy a house. Suddenly, affliction will strike somewhere. They will say you should bring the money. Suddenly, somebody will die. The money you have been saving to do something good, you go and use it for burial. Can I tell you, sir? Can I tell you, ma? In that name that is above every other name. If that has been your experience over here, it comes to an end today. I said that story today. In the name of Jesus. Those are the activities of repressive forces. They monitor you. Under the forces of repression are monitoring powers and forces. They put you under their wash. I decree here right now. Any power that have put in your destiny under wash, let the thunderbolt of the Lord scatter them in the name of Jesus. Brother, say a louder amen. Something is happening here this morning. Something is going to happen here this morning. You keep on wondering why did they know that I have money? It is when you have gathered, 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 they will come with their own. Mm. They will do what? They will come with their own. Before you know it, all you have labored for for the year, you cannot account for it anymore. That is repressive forces. They just want to make sure that there is a certain level you can never go beyond. You can never move above that. And you have look at yourself when you save money. Some you all may be just ten thousand naira. Once they see that you have up to ten thousand naira, they will come. When you see that they have, you have gathered up to one million naira, they will come. Repressive forces, the Midianite forces, the Amalekite forces. They make sure that you don't make any advancement. They tie you down, unknown to you. You are just on the same spot. Hello. I have good news for you. I know somebody who was under that condition but one day walked into his promotion and that fellow is called Gideon. That was the experience of Gideon. So they said that he went and was hiding under the cave but one faithful morning he walked into his promotion because the great promoter appeared unto him and defined his destiny for him. Hello? You didn't hear me, sir. The great promoter did what? Appeared unto him and defined his destiny for him that come, you are not made to be under repression. As a matter of fact, I have destined you to be a mighty man of valor. And you know what? I am with you. He said, what? Lord, you are with me? How come? He said, let me confirm if you are with me. Suddenly, he offered a sacrifice. He saw that the encounter he was having has to do with great promoter because the fire of the sacrifice went well. Oh, and from that day onward, because his sacrifice went up, his destiny began to go up. I pray for somebody here today in that name that is above every other name your destiny will go up. If you are saying amen, say loud and clear. So, sir, so, man, he walked into his promotion that day. And from that day onward, Gideon never go down again. Hear me as I hear God. On the account of what God is about to do right away, you will never go down again. Because you have walked into your promotion already. That you came here this morning. You have already walked into your promotion. I say you have walked into your promotion. I say you have walked into your promotion. Every repressive force shall leave you alone. Every power of repression shall be let loose. 
over your life. Uh, when will that one happen, sir? Stand up, let us pray. Let us pray. Brother, we are going somewhere. Sorry, I couldn't go much. But don't worry. No, Nobody is pursuing us. We will get there. If Gideon, under that condition, got his promotion, your own day is when? No. Oh, Friday. No. Next month. No. Next year. No. Who believe it's today? No. Sir, what God has deposited in you will manifest. Yeah. For the great promoter said to him, Thou mighty man of valor. And he said, I have now come. Because, sir, you get lifted in the atmosphere of peace. He said, no more trouble for you. I am manifesting myself to you at Jehovah Shalom. Oh, my God. I thought you would clap. I thought you would clap. So, you want to take several prayer points with, 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 with all your energy. With all what? All those that have been coming to collect what you gather. When you gather for it, they come and collect. Hey! And end come today. Lift up your two hands. Say, Father! You can do better, sir. Say, Father! Ara! Deliver me today! Let me not suffer other to eat. Can you lift up your voice and talk to the Almighty God? I will not suffer other to eat. Kaliba koka pala baba baba baba. Rakata gaza kata la baba baba. Ropoto gazikale brando gazanta li mama. Ke guda batu gale brando gazanta li ha. Shembalale katu gaga marupoto gabrande gazanta li ha. Celebrate gaga gaga gaga. Zeleba to kache tali mama. Skata la baba baba kata gabo skata. Ah, kale mama kasanta. In Jesus mighty name we are praying. Lift up your voice, Father. Arise by fire. Power waiting for me to gather for them to scatter. Oh, you didn't hear that one. Power's waiting for me to gather for them to scatter. Oh God, my Father, pursue my fire. Go ahead and talk to the Almighty God. Let God pursue your pursuers. <laughs> Power that wait for you to gather for them to scatter. Kale brodo kasanta libaba basuta branda. Oh, my Santa Lababa Calibra de Casanta Lababa. Oh, Pasanta Labrada Casanta Lia. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Lift up your voice and say, Father, power that walk that, that caused me to walk in vain, power that walk me to labor in vain. Holding on to my destiny. What are you waiting for? Leave me alone. No. Go ahead, talk to the Almighty God. Power that make a man to labor in vain. <laughs> so that you can remain on the same spot. <laughs> what are you waiting for? Leave me alone by fire. <laughs> Command that to leave me alone. My super level shantali. Raka kakakaka. Raka kakaka. Papa le gaso la ba chantale rege re 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 gaso tale baba pro mama 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 chele le 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 gaso tale baba eh leave me alone leave me alone leave me alone leave me alone but they pray for your deliverance command them to leave me alone ma chantale wherever they are praying from from your father's house from your mother's house from covers of witches and wizards from satanic altars from mani kingdom let them leave me alone ma sapala lo Zazaza, papa mama kashente lele. Salabranda kasantalia. Kakaba la baba baba kasantalia. Jele lele 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 lele. Kapole basutalia. In Jesus, mighty name, we have prayed. 
lift up your voice and say father power that be taking away my blessing I come out return my blessing open your mouth and talk to the mighty God power that be taking away your blessing oh let them return it now <laughs> let them return your blessing because your promotion is now <laughs> power that will be taking away your blessing command them to return your blessing by fire 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 aha kakaba yela bo chantalia bregedere zale prodo go santali mama kele bakuta gazanda are you praying at all? Hey, ketene lebo, si pate gaga. Ka la branda baba. You can't take away my blessing. No power will take away your blessing. In the name of Jesus. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. They take away your contract. They take away your promotion. They take away your money. Hey, kakaba baba. They take away your opportunity. They take away your job. Let them return it now. I see returning. I see recovery. I see restoration. Masukalaboska. Thank you, mighty father. Hey, Jesus. Mighty name, they are returned. Brother, lift up your two hands and stretch it like this. Because something wants to happen. Hear me as I hear God. Masapale Boska. Zamale kakakakaka. Anything they have taken away from you. Brother, do your hand like this. Do your hand like this. Look at me. Do your hand like this. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Take it back. 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 Take it. 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 I said, take it. 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 Let them return. Let them return. Let them return it now. In the name of Jesus. Now say after me several times. I collect it back. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven. Mama, 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 mama. That's it. That's it. It's yours. <laughs> it's yours. It's yours. It's yours. Enough is enough. Now, little those two hands. We are still there. And I say, Father, 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 let me manifest who you have made me. You make it not to manifest who you made him. I know you did not make me poor. I know you do not make me a servant. You have made me greater. Let me manifest who you have made me. It is my season of promotion. Let me manifest who you have made me. Is somebody praying at all? Lord, let me manifest who you have made me. You have made me to be greater. Eh, masatole masantalia. Hey, baba, mama, 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 mama. Lord, let me manifest who you have made me. Almighty Father, <laughs> let me manifest who you have made me. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Now, the final one. I don't even know whether I have crossed seven prayer point. It's just flowing like a river. Lift up your two hands. Hey! That day, the great promoter appeared. He said, No more repression. <laughs> He said, you are hereby promoted. He said, go in this power of thy mind. <laughs> Say, I am going in the power of my promotion. To manifest my promotion. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I am going <laughs> in the power of promotion. As I step out of here, I am going in the power of promotion. To manifest my promotion. Sapunda lika kabayale. Nim brande gazunta balibaba. Rokoto gazandalala. Shentelele kakababa. Keke lebo shantali. Bodi matu tanda brande. Kukapande lele gagu kaka. Shampala, shampala, shampala. Ripapa masantu. Le prokoto gazantalia. Re gazunta lima. Thank you, mighty father. And so shall it be in Jesus' name. Alagara <laughs> lolo rumi, lift up your hands. Alagara ni Jesus mi o, to bati soro. The great promoter that encountered Gideon, <laughs> that ended every repression in his life, and he walked into his promotion. May that God encounter you today in the name of Jesus. 
answer you speedily. Every prayer you have prayed, it had about Jesus. Cause you to manifest who he had made you, it had about Jesus. That you will no longer labor in vain. Those that have been collecting what you gather will return them. Those that scatter as you gather, an end has come, it had about Jesus. Go and manifest your greatness. Go and manifest your promotion, your financial promotion, your spiritual promotion, your physical promotion, your marital promotion. Go and manifest in that about Jesus. And so shall it be. In the name of God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit. Oh my God. Is it getting better? I told you. <laughs> Walking into your promotion, somebody will testify. I am looking forward to that day. You will line up here. We will just be taking only testimonies. And it's coming to pass. For some of you, before the end of this week, I mean before the end of this week, I will receive a message from you. Lift up your offering and say, Father, you have done it already. I seal it with my seed. That from this day, no more repression. I am delivered totally from repressive forces in the name of Jesus. Go ahead, touch to the Almighty God. Send your offering on errand. Masuka leba to kashen tali mama. Oh, Marika kaplabos kate. Zilamote gazin tali brando koko santa. And so shall it be in Jesus' name. With your seed, your victory is sealed. Let God accept your sacrifice. And may your testimony be heard. Amen. Name of God the Father, Amen. God the Son, Amen. God the Holy Spirit. Amen. Who got the bigger blessing? We say the loudest Amen. Amen, Amen. Amen like thunder. Amen. Congratulations. Amen. Tell your neighbor, why are you not congratulating me? I said, tell your neighbor, why are you not congratulating me? Are you jealous? <laughs> Let somebody shout hallelujah. Amen and amen and amen. They will surely congratulate you. And we continue from where we start tomorrow. Sama, don't miss what God is doing because I will hear your testimony. Shall we share the grace of fellowship?